Becky Brandt, why don't you just come right on up here because you're close to. Y'all come on up. Can you turn it back now? I'll, I think I'm far enough away from it. Yes. You just put them in order for me. Our deacon is here. Hey, uh, Daniel Clay Strong, bring me that microphone, that red one right there. Our little deaconess girl here, Vicki Brandt, is going to baptize her granddaughter. Hallelujah. <laughs> I want to tell you all a little story real quick about Get the close to your mouth, honey, because it's hard I want to tell you a story about Kaylin. <clears throat> On July the 20th of 2013, she came to my house and she had a lot of questions about Jesus in heaven because she had lost her dad and her papa. So we talked about it. We talked about heaven, how nice it was and that Jesus lived there. And she said she wanted to go to heaven. And she wanted Jesus in her heart and in her life. So we prayed, and she invited Jesus into her heart. And, you know, that was four years ago. And after we prayed, she put her little arms like this. And I said, Kaylin, what are you doing? And she said, I'm hugging my Jesus because he lives in my heart. And, you know, she's got such a heart for God. And before we even prayed, she said, Mama, I have to be the one to say in Jesus' name, amen. And she does have such a heart for God. She prays for people. She prays about things. And she has such a tender spirit. And I know that it's because Jesus lives in her heart. Amen. And I'm so proud of her today. <clears throat> Why are you getting baptized? Because I love Jesus. That's right. <laughs> Amen. the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. 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 <laughs> she held her down too long. <laughs> no, she didn't. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. Yeah. Who we got next? Rebecca, Grace, Stewart, where are you? Another one of our deacons is going to baptize his daughter. Rebecca. Rebecca, Grace, Stewart. Want to say anything, Michael Dale? Yeah. Seems like I've known her my whole life. <laughs> no, but ever since she was old enough to even know anything, she's always loved Jesus. And Rebecca, why would you like to get baptized today? Because I want to show that I, that I let Jesus into my heart. Amen. I don't think we need to say any more than that, huh? Amen. I want to say something. Let's see. Rebecca, as you go into the water and as... You're under the water, and as you come out, everything that was old, everything that was sick and diseased, yes, Jesus, 
is all left in the yes, water. Yes, Lord, let it be. Let it and be. when you come out, you're going to be all brand new. Amen. Yes, Lord. Thank Can you Jesus. believe that? All righty. Praise Amen. God. Amen. Thank you, Father. Amen. We believe that in her physical body and with her physical Amen. symptoms, Lord. They're going to be gone, too, Amen. in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. Rebecca Grace, we baptize you in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Ghost. Rise up and walk a new life in Jesus' name. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> Bless the Lord, bless the Lord. Yeah. Who's closest to us? Jessica or Deanna or, oh, or Samantha. Whoever, come on up here. Whichever one of you gets up here first is going to get it. Deanna, you want to say anything? Okay, so just hop in there then. She uh, just sit all the way down. She came to me a few weeks ago and she said, I think I need to be rebaptized. And uh, people ask me all the time about being rebaptized. And is it, is it scriptural? Is it okay to do it? Well, of course it's okay to do it. Actually, in the scripture, when John the Baptist was baptizing people, uh, pe people would be baptized more than once. And uh, because if you turn and go the wrong way after you were baptized the first time, it just does something for your soul. Now, it don't, make, it don't get you to heaven. Baptism doesn't get you to heaven. But it just does something for your soul to say, hey, I'm, I am coming home and I'm making a new profession and I'm moving in the right direction. Amen. In the book of Revelation, it says, Repent from where you have fallen and do the first works again. Amen. And so that's, what I, that's the answer I give people when they ask this question. But I'm proud of Deanna for recognizing that I need to take a step and, uh, and I need to make that recommitment. And I'm so proud of you. And she's got six months clean. And so we're very proud of her. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. All right, sister, grab your nose. Deanna, by the authority of the Lord Jesus Christ, I baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Rise up and walk a new life in Jesus' name. <laughs> Woo, hallelujah. New day. New day. Praise the mighty name of Jesus. Praise the mighty name of Jesus. Stretch your hand out toward her. Father, we put a seal around her. A seal and a shield and the bloodline, Father, that the devil shall not cross. Father, we thank you for a new day of victory. And the old is gone and the new has come in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. The spirit of death that was once on you is gone in the name of Jesus. Amen. And never to return in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. The mighty name of Jesus. You are free. Bless the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Jessica. Jessica Garrett, come on. And then Samantha, we'll, we'll do you after Jessica. Can you get in those water? Jessica, you're get, coming to get baptized today. And... Uh, uh, Deanna shared with her, she shared with you about what baptism meant, didn't she? Do you love Jesus? Is he in your life? Is he in your heart? Do you want to say anything? It's okay, sit down. <laughs> Jessica, by the authority of the name of Jesus, I baptize you in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Ghost. Rise up and walk a new life. In Jesus' name. Nancy, pray a pray, prayer pray, pray, blessing over her after she gets out of there. Hallelujah. Can you yes. get out there, honey? Oh, 
Heavenly Father, we thank you so much for Jessica, for her life, for her rededication to you. Lord, we thank you that for her too, this is a new day. Father, of blessing, of glory, of thank change. You, Jesus. Father, that she's turning her back on the world and the flesh and the devil and what they have to offer. And Lord, she's going to move forward and follow move Jesus forward. all the move days forward. of her follow life. Jesus. All the days of her life. Lord, I ask Jesus. you to bless her, protect her from anything that's been a hindrance or a difficulty in the past. I pray she'll have favor with people. You, Lord, you said Jesus crew, and he had favor with God and with people. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 Come on up here, Samantha. Samantha already told me she don't want to say nothing. Okay. Oh, now she's going to. <laughs> Get it close to your mouth, honey, so we can hear you. As a lot of you guys know, um, I'm a recovering addict. Um, I've got five months clean as of the sixth. And I thought I could do it without God being in my life. And I got, thought I could do it on my own, but I cannot do it without God. I started coming to church here, and he's with me, and he's helping me through this. And I want to thank my family for helping me through this and being with me through this. And Adam, my husband, for loving me and staying by my side. Amen. 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 <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> I've been there, sister. Just sit down with your feet that way. There you go. Grab your nose. There you go. I hope this Fitbit works after this. I've already dunked it twice. <laughs> Grab your nose. Samantha Roberts, on your profession of faith in the Lord Jesus Christ, I baptize you in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Rise up and walk in a new life in Jesus' name. Anybody have anything for her? Anybody want to pray over her? Nancy, do a prayer over her. Yes. Pray a blessing. Father, thank you. Thank you, Lord, for her willingness to receive from your spirit and from your help, Lord. Thank you, Father. God, you said that with man a lot of things are impossible, but with God all things are possible. Lord, we thank you that her new day is like the, Lord, you said the path of the righteous and we're righteous because of your blood the, our path now is bright like the sun like the sunrise it gets brighter and brighter and brighter till the full day hallelujah lord thank you for samantha i just ask you to crown her with your loving kindness and your strength and your glory in jesus name amen amen glory to god well, Vicki Brent's got something going. Where are you, Vic? Nancy, I need you to come up and stand up here. Also, when these people are dry, we have their five baptism certificates. So that they can yeah, them. give that to Vicki Brown. She'll give it to them. Can all the children's church kids come up front, please? If you belong in children's church, please come up front. I want you all to know that sometimes Nancy has, she has 29 a few weeks ago, and uh, some of these weren't even there, and uh, I think, uh, go ahead. You know, Miss Nancy takes really good care of our kids, and she's such an awesome teacher, and does such a good job teaching them manners, teaches them about Jesus and about love, and all that fun stuff. Well, tomorrow is her birthday, and as you know, she never forgets one of these kids on their birthday. Never. And so I want all the kids to sing happy birthday to Miss Nancy, and they're going to have cake when they get in the no back. Way. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> so, Pastor, do you want to lead it? 
Happy, 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 Sing. happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Pastor Nancy. Happy birthday to you. And to Maria, too. <laughs> Hallelujah. Oh, look, Miss Vicki. Well, Pretty flowers for us. The adults us. didn't forget about you either. Yay. So this Hoorah. is from the grown-ups. Happy birthday. Bless the Lord. Now, y'all can go uh, follow Pastor. Uh, well, well, we are, and I'm waiting for something to happen for if, the, if somebody will move just a little bit faster. Hang on just one second. <laughs> uh, you know what? My, uh, I, my son Daniel and, and his wife Brittany uh, celebrated uh, 10 years. Uh, on Friday, anniversary, 10 long years, I mean, uh, 10 short years of victory. <laughs> you want to say anything about that, Daniel? It's awesome. It's been the best thing ever. Booyah. Booyah. All right, he did better than I did, didn't he? <laughs> All right, you can take the children to Children's Church, and thank you. Y'all enjoy. Go back and enjoy that cake. Praise God for kids. We got a lot of kids per capita, don't we? the Lord. Daniel, can you get on the drums real quick? Mm.